Have you ever considered participating in an open mic night? Well, this locally based bar has one every Tuesday. Last week, I got the privilege of attending, and this is what it was like. So I'm Hunter, um, and I'm one of the co-owners of uh, the Atrium, as well as the Alley Cat Coffee House. Basically, we started the open mic as uh, kind of a replacement for the open mic that used to happen up in the Alley Cat Coffee House. And yeah, it's been, it's been a really fun time so far. Probably one of my favorite things about it is it's, it's a really supportive community. So um, what I've found is that we have everything from extremely experienced musicians uh, to people who are like really amateurs or novices. They're all really supportive of one another. So like there's, there's no act that's really too small um, to give it a shot out here. It can be a little intimidating, but um, I think that the community really rises to support that here. I think most people do struggle with getting up in front of people and they get pretty nervous and um, that makes sense um, and, I, and that's a beautiful thing about open mics, that's literally what they're designed for so um, I encourage people to come out, come try it, um, maybe the first time come, come see it and you'll really experience and see the setting and the environment we provide here. We really love the local music scene here. Like it's a big, uh, a big impetus for opening this place was kind of catering to like that, uh, maybe that like in between step with fans that you know haven't quite gotten a foot in the door in some of the bigger venues. And uh, over the last year, we've grown to, to have a lot of really, um, really outstanding acts play the space. Um, so yeah, if you're a musician, come hang out. Um, if you're not, also come hang out. We'd love to have you. I loved the atrium. I loved the vibes and the Austin and Hunter were just awesome to talk yeah, to. Yeah, it was amazing. And I got to go with her to open mic and honestly, I got to say it was amazing. Um, Mitchell, the guy who's doing the finger picking, was so insane. I've never seen anything like that oh, before. Yeah. We'll, we'll definitely be back. <laughs> yeah, and if you guys want to see some unique music, we suggest going. But for right now, that's all we have for you. But stick around, Rams, because right after the break, we will be talking about musical news in the state of Colorado. Stay tuned.